Hello everyone, my name is Fajar Erika. On behalf of the authors, I want to share you my presentation entitled Linguistic Landscape as a Tool to Promote Tourism in Bandung City During Implementation of the New Normal. When we talk about Bandung, Bandung is one of the biggest city in Indonesia, which located in the west of uh, Java Island. Bandung has been a tourist city since the colonial era. However, uh, since COVID-19 pandemic, there have been restrictions on tourism activities in Bandung. No tourism means no economic activity. So that's why around July this year, uh, the local government uh, has begun implementing the new normal or they call it adaptation to new habit. This moment is also used to start tourism activities while following health protocols until the pandemic is over. In this current situation, we think it is important to protect ourselves and stay healthy during this pandemic so that it is important to make a public communication strategy in order to uh, make the community, the society compliant and resilient or patuh dan tangguh in Indonesian. So the ultimate goals uh, we think is uh, community compliance and resilience. Regarding in Indonesian context, uh, Indonesia is a multi-ethnic country with a multilingual situation that's why we need a multiple approach to overcome this kind of problem so at this moment we want to recommend uh, some intervention uh, through a social political social cultural approach uh, that we can do the first one is information collection dissemination Items that can save people during this pandemic, such as the mask, hand sanitizer, and etc. The second is utilization of monuments or iconic landscape. As we know that uh, currently uh, the the government uh, plan to put the big mass uh, into the General Sudirman statue around General Sudirman Street in South uh, Jakarta in order to encourage people to always use their mask when going uh, outside and the third is making icons or symbols from simple objects via billboards posters or banners therefore the focus and scope of this paper is the use linguistic landscape or LL media for intervention there are two primary questions uh, in this presentation the first one is what is the role of ll and ll actors in building awareness during the new normal uh, ll actors are the city government tourists both domestic and foreign tourists as well as community uh, such as business actors or local communities and the second question is how to measure the effectiveness or awareness building the was carried out during the new normal okay in the next slide uh, we have theoretical framework as a, a basic concept uh, when we talk about uh, linguistic landscape uh, ll itself uh, firstly uh, proposed by landry and borges uh, they defini they gave a definition uh, the language of public road names advertising billboards street names place name uh, and also public science on government building uh, and linguistic landscape have uh, two functions as a information and symbolic uh, function also uh, there, there are uh, LL explanation uh, in terms of uh, tourism context uh, tourism city context such as uh, in Japan context uh, Chinatown in US and Thailand Bangkok uh, Bangkok, Thailand, and also in Bali, Indonesia. In Indonesia, LL as a tool were used to attract tourists visit by the local government, such as Yogyakarta government and uh, Malang uh, city in the east of Java Island.
you can see on uh, this picture several uh, tourists uh, took picture behind the street name signage and even there were uh, a couple took a pre-wedding phot photography uh, as a part of their uh, preparation for their wedding and this is uh, how the local government uh, attract the tourists uh, by using a street name signage also this is from uh, Malang city they use uh, a Dutch uh, street names uh, a past street name as a tool to attract the visitors the tourists to their city for data sources, uh, we are using Google Street View uh, to grab some photos. Uh, so uh, we think they are still considered uh, relevant to use on this uh, explanation. In order to answer the first questions, main question like I uh, said previously, it is important to involve uh, the government as a main LL actors to promote the tourism uh, by using the linguistic landscape. The government can create three-dimensional street themes uh, are made in large enough open space. Uh, for example, what uh, Bandung municipality do several years ago, they created a Braga street name statue and put it in open space and after that, uh, some people, some tourists uh, took a picture behind the statue. Based on this example, uh, we propose uh, the local government duplicate it to the another street names. Uh, we propose uh, Jalan Dago or Dago street names uh, as a second uh, tourist spot after the Braga street names. And the second things uh, the government can be do is uh, create the sticker machine uh, for what i will explain it in the next slide by using the sticker machine uh, the tourists can write the abbreviation or acronyms of the two street names both braga and dago creatively also domestic tourists can write the abbreviation acronym uh, into their local language or mother tongue for example japanese batak or minang uh, we created a sample of a sticker, uh, acronym of uh, Braga Street Names, B, uh, Bersihkan Tangan Selalu, in English, uh, Always Clean and Wash Your Hands, R, Renggangkan Jarak, or Maintain Distance When Talking, A, Awas Selalu, or Always Be Aware of Your Surroundings, G, Gunakan Masker, or use a mask when leaving the house and a antisipasi bersin dan batuk anticipate sneezing or coughing and the third uh, party that we think uh, need to take part on this uh, campaign is a community uh, the community means the owners of hotels restaurants cafes and other commercial places they encourage to make a stickers uh, of acronym like the tourists uh, did uh, by using machine sticker uh, uh, and they can install the stickers uh, to strategic spot inside or outside commercial places such as uh, in front of entrance, hotel reception desk and etc. To answer the second uh, main question of this presentation uh, after we uh, did the program or campaign uh, it is it is common to evaluate uh, the effectiveness the successfulness of the program by the uh, conduct by the several LL actors right uh, and by using several methods such as questionnaires interviews as well as observation we can uh, evaluate the successfulness of the program in conclusion this article is an academic paper which is an extract from a number of previous studies that have examined the relationship between LL implementation and tourism 
The study is expected to be a contribution from the scholars to the government of Bandung in particular and the government of Indonesia in general on how language devices can be used as a means of campaign for tourism and the new normal conditions set by the government. In campaigning for these two things, a social and cultural strategy, as well as practical and attractive ways are needed so that uh, the compliant and resilient uh, community as a national goal can be achieved. In addition, the authors expect that the strategy can have an impact on increasing the number of tourists, which will automatically have an impact on the stabilization of the local economy. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, that's all what I need to share with you. Uh, thank you for your attention and see you.